When I've just got onto this strange horse that's probably been in training quite, possibly quite fresh, this horse actually, because he lives here, he's obviously being quiet and being a good boy. But I'm not gonna do anything initially, see what he feels like, whether he's got his back up. If he has been a bit fresh, as I said, you know, it might be a good idea to lunge the horse first and see if it bucks or if it is a little bit on edge. You're on him now, you can see that he's quiet. Now this horse is having a good spook and I would let him look at all these spooky things around the arena and give him time and let him have a spook at it, but also sit, sit tight. Because if he decides to whip round, I don't want to be falling off. I'm just gonna now have a little trot round with him and leave him alone just to begin with. See what you've got, see how it feels. Now. A lot of racehorses haven't really been taught to go on the bit. They've been ridden by uh, the, the lads that ride a lot shorter than what I'm riding at the moment. And they don't really understand to take a contact. So what I want him to do is to drop his head so that he is using his back. And the thoroughbred horses generally don't use their back as well as they could do, um, and especially a racehorse that you're wanting to turn round to do dressage.